Hello, and welcome back to Simplified Sunday Readings at St. Charles on this 16th Sunday of Ordinary Time. Sheep are animals who need humans to take care of them, to keep them safe and find good food to eat. Today, our readings include God promising new rulers to act like shepherds to watch over God's people. Did you know that King David did watch sheep when he was a young child? Do you think that sounds like fun? As Christians, we see Jesus as the shepherd that God sent to us. This is a reading from the prophet Jeremiah. Our God says, Listen, you who are shepherds of my flock, you have not taken good care of my people, but I myself will gather my flock and bring them back from all over the world. I will ask other shepherds to take care of them so that my people will be together and not be afraid any longer. I will send someone from the family of David to my people. He will be a wise king, and he will do what is right. The people will be saved, and they will know that I am their God, and that I am just. The word of the Lord and we say thanks be to God. Again, we Christians usually also think the shepherd in the psalm is Jesus looking after us. My shepherd is the Lord, nothing indeed shall I want. You, Lord, are my shepherd. I will never be in need. You let me rest in fields of green grass. You lead me to streams of peaceful water, and you refresh my life. My shepherd is the Lord. Nothing indeed shall I want. You are true to your name, and you lead me along the right paths. I may walk through valleys as dark as death, but I won't be afraid. You are with me, and your shepherd's rod makes me feel safe. My shepherd is the Lord. Nothing indeed shall I want. Your kindness and love will always be with me every day of my life, and I will live forever in your house, Lord. My shepherd is the Lord, nothing indeed shall I want. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. My sheep listen to my voice, says the Lord. I know them and they follow me. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Since we are reading the Gospel of Mark in order this year, it helps to remember that last week, Jesus sent his followers out to preach and heal people. This week, we hear when they came back. This is a reading from the Gospel of Mark. After the disciples had been out teaching, they came to Jesus to tell him everything they had done and what they had taught. But so many people were coming to be with Jesus and his disciples that they didn't even have time to eat. So Jesus said to them, Come with me. We will go to a quiet place where we can rest for a while. So they went in a boat 
to a place where they could be alone. But some people saw them leaving and told others where they were going. So people from all around ran to the place and got there before Jesus and his disciples. When Jesus saw all the people waiting for him, he felt sorry for them because they were like sheep who didn't have a shepherd. So Jesus stayed with them and taught them many things. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise be to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Here is our gospel telling us about a time that Jesus did see the people looking like stray sheep who needed him to look after them the way a shepherd does. Have you ever tried to help one person and then saw someone else who also needed help? What did you do? Jesus started out to find a place for his disciples to rest. Do you think Jesus was fair to his followers? And as always, thank you for joining me today. And let's all continue to meet Jesus in the Eucharist, in the words of the Bible, and in each other.